Yo, 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 Well, I and I man just forward half of the road. It was a very eventful weekend. We did Atlanta. We did New York last night. So big up to the fans, them. You know where? Yeah, love the music. Still, I support the music. Um, you don't know, so I always go now hundred percent with my forward. So give thanks to the eye them for push by the energy. So I say. Yeah man, so, you know, it was like crazy, crazy vibe for the past two weeks. Or even more than that, I was up on the road for a minute now, up on the road. Trust me, it's like, it's like I feel truly, truly, um, I feel truly blessed. You know, with the amount of work when I have, the amount of work when I get, big up to the promoter, them were still at Vegas where, when no say from your water, energy that I show you the hit songs them and you want the dance of you know you can't draw for Mr. Vegas. So big up all the promoter them way. You know, still a book Mr. Vegas. And of course you know we do we part the dancers them, Tabby them, um, you know, all the dancers them. Yes, I say Adrian. Zayn, yeah man, the DJ them, Joe Young. Yes, I say, big up on yourself, man, cause team thing, yes, I say. Jay the dancer. Very much, eh? Mm hmm. Great vibe. Yeah, and contrary to when of people, you know, believe, say, if you're up on social media, um, your career got dry up, you no longer have no career, blah, blah, blah. All of that are just bull crap. And we prove them wrong time and time again, and we continue to be, we continue to be me. I continue to speak on social issues, I continue and I still do it and I continue to do it. I understand what I say? Because there's something that I enjoy doing, I love reason upon um, social issues, I love reason upon things that are happening in the space. You see? I don't rob, I don't thief, I don't kill nobody. I don't beat up nobody, I don't send nobody to kill nobody. I don't do drugs. I don't influence nobody to do drugs. All of them something there. You see? Big up my brother, he's up, you know. You don't know, man. Carla. Yeah. Robert. You don't know a team show up last night and show out. Be a sitting. You see? So, two minutes, I just do a little reason. Intro and then we go on to the reason. Because the reason is a big reason, you know. The reason here tonight is a big, big reason. Why reason tonight? Big reasoning. The reason is well overdue. This is a well. Overdue reasoning. Big reasoning out for going, you know. Big people reasoning. It's not like a little petty reasoning. You see? And of course, I know so there are fans out there who, who just wish Mr. Vegas would have just stick to the music alone and don't come on social media, come talk about some things. But here we go on now. If you love the cow, you have to take a calf. You see what I say? Yeah. <coughs> if you allow the cow, you have to take a calf. That's how you go. Because mm. I'm not on social media, I'm going to find one bar to drink. I'm going to drink rum. I'm going to drink ton alcohol. I'm going to drink junkie. I'm going to go ball when I when me sick in the hospital and my teeth them drop out and I go say, Oh, I can't believe I'm a good, good artist that star. I'm going to go fund me for him. I could get him some money to take care of himself. Yeah, and camera on Miss Dana. I don't know camera on Miss Dana, Clark. I don't know camera on Miss Dana, you know. I'm an idiot, man. I go continue to just stay in my house, go work, come home, then in my house, I'm in my house, I chat with me, I want to chat. Reason me want, reason me go, go work, take care of my pit, them, take care of my family. Them. I don't know Clark, see me a road that drink and smoke and one bag of sitting. No, I just saw a thing there. Easy, dirty. 
All right, so what's the reasoning I know people? We're talking about love and hip hop, see? Big reasoning. Love and hip hop, we're talking about. Love and hip hop. See? No. By now, everybody's supposed to see the clipping where um, Safari, um, baby mother. Safari's baby mother um, and Spice got into it. And of course, um, his baby's mother, yeah, his baby mother, um, you some ex-wife, sorry, sorry, ex-wife, thanks Megs, ex-wife, me never know when I'm married, ex-wife, so Safari's ex-wife, is it, it's a, a real relationship, so Safari's ex-wife and Spice got into it, um, and um, during the altercation and the words throwing, Erica um, used some derogatory or some racial um, slurs or comments, uh, threw some racial words or comments towards Spice by calling her a blue monk. Zin, I want to get flagged on the page. We're going to say blue monk. Now, We all know that whenever um, whenever I hear people refer to black people as monk, we know that they have some, you know, form of racial, you know, uh, meaning attached to it, or intent. You know, it's like somebody want to call you a monk. That's the matter. So it's a trigger word. Or those are some, you know, trigger words when you. You know, black monk, because nobody is a black monk. But that time I know too, you know, it's a spice of the blue here, she call her blue monk. See? So, of course, we saw what happened and she got fired, quote unquote, fired. Zin from the show. Uh, so, make a reason for that. So, we understand the intro. We get a synopsis of what I talk about. Zin, again, Safari's ex wife, Erica, she and Spice got into an altercation and they tried to throw in words at each other and word fling and the lady called her a blue monk M-O-N-K-E-Y and um, people saw that or heard that when the show aired some people got into them feelings and started saw them fire that are the intro see Now, I have a whole heap of um, different angles that I can take this from. But I'm going to start with um, the show, Love and Hip Hop. What is Love and Hip Hop? What are these, what are these shows? What are these um, reality shows? Huh? What are these reality shows? Now, in my view, them reality shows here, because I used to see them all the time. They come from a girl named I Love New York, and then it you know, then we, 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 we got to Kim Kardashian, so forth. Kim Kardashian came out, they said about the fake, and um, everybody just tuned into them TV and tuned into her and start following her, and she just became a billionaire by people just don't like her or people like her. So people just start following them and they became billionaires, and her sisters them jump in too, and the mother jump in, and the father jump in, and the father turn, change him in my identity, and the sister. Be, became a billionaire and she was short of some some millions to be, become a billionaire and her fans them gave her the money to become a billionaire so it's so we know the reality she was coming from from I love New York with flavor them flavor flavor you know until we get to these love and hip hop and all I love love and hip hop New York love and hip hop Atlanta love and hip hop California love and hip hop blah, 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 blah. but who are these people that them show up on these shows a lot of the people were upon them shows here are people that um, are industry people, put it that way. Some of them are producers, some of them are artists that no longer um, have a buzzing career, and some of them are upcoming artists who, who are trying to get breaks. And some of them are some people who are trying to become actors and actresses. And it never works out, and them just get this idea of throw them into 
the show. I heard this thing, yeah. Because I love Anipa. So some people were trying to get a career. Some people were trying to bust. Some people were, did have a career. And them something there. Some people did want to be a movie star and never work out for them. All in internet. So in the English format, these are some people that um, you know, are from the industry. Some are not popping anymore. Um, so, <laughs> yeah, make some delisted people, if you want to call it that. You know? Or B. Yeah, if you want to call it that. So some people don't really have nothing really a pop or they might try pop. See, so them find a little home for them and say, all right, yeah. Them dealist people, yeah, we have a little thing we can't show them into. Now, because in my opinion, now, these shows are not you know, properly scripted and there's no real talent, no real movie star. Them people are not real movie star. Them are not real actors and real actresses. So some people just take some people and show them into a room, show them into a house, and just say, all right, we're going to put on the camera. That is it. You see? It's just some people. Boom. Show them, that, show, show them in our room and put on the camera. Let the camera run. That is it. One, two, three. Camera. Boom. That's it. In my view. It's nothing where them have to go and rehearse them lines and come back and be, you know, you know, study them, them parts and come back and them have to say them part and act them part and them audition feet and all. It's none of that. It's just like put on a camera. Lights. Action. Boom. Fight. You see? Light, camera, action. Fight. You see? Because it's no real thing. It's not a real thing. It's not a real thing where, you know, it's not scripted. Like, go home and take the script and learn it and learn your body language and all of them things. And, you know, you have to know when to hold the smile and when not to smile and all. No, it's no proper thing like that. It's just like lights, camera, action, fight. DJ Ray said scripted. Well, yeah, it may be scripted in a, in a, in a way where fight. Now that's the script. Fight. Cause. See? That is what me see. <laughs> me not no, see no treatment, no script. Me not see no that. Uh, yeah. So, if you are going to have a bunch of people that you group together and throw them into a dramatic situation and always allow them to fight, throw things, turn over table, spit on each other, all of these things. Why are we surprised now that you call Spice a blue monk. A, what? Are we surprised? Because I used to think say stage them, stage the fight, the fight them. So when I when I saw the thing come out, first and foremost, we know that Spice and this woman here have problems or whatever, and we thought it was acting. When we saw Spice in the airport on her phone and Spice a cuss her out and Spice attack how her, how her pum pum stink and what kind of something in her pum pum all kind of leptospirosis as she said chukumungu zung some something in her pum pum some something she said her pum pum have some something right so we hear Spice a out this woman here and I say so we think she's acting you see or I thought it was just acting. This is like two, three months ago, you know. So finally, the thing aired a few days ago. You see? And when we see Spice at the airport, of course, it's actually a part of the show. I wonder if you understand what I mean. When we saw Spice in the airport cussing, telling her our pum pum stink and all of them things there, you know. It's part of the show, you know. It's a part of the show. You know? 
So when everybody they get caught up in a in a what price has about her and all of these things and people are jumping at excited and all of these things. Only never is a part of the show. And here we get this thing now. If Spice was cussing her out two months ago, Zim, and I say all of these things about her, which some people were like, why would you say that about the woman? That's not nice for you to say. Remember, we don't know about the blue, the blue monk thing yet, you know. We never know about that yet, you know. So when we see Spice Akosar, Zin, we are say, well, Andy, that not sound good. That not sound good. Lo and behold, the show was already recorded when Spice Akosar in the airport. Spice Cousin in the airport is a series that came after the Blue Monk argument, you know. The Blue Monk argument was already recorded, people. So ask yourself that question now. Ask yourself that question here. If the Blue Monk argument our racial slurs them, whatever, was recorded a few months ago before spicing at the airport a cossar. Why them release it? With a quote unquote Latino calling a black woman M O N K E Y. Why them release it? You see, that is what happened when them take up some delisted people, in my opinion. Or some people will try to get a break. Or some people want to really get a break. It, and they throw them into a room and say, fight. Them have them as nobody. Them have them as some degenerate. Them have them as some people. You, know, you understand me? I say, them have them like idiots. Them have, whatever, whatever. You know what? Take, you know what? Put upon them. Rejects of the society or the industry. I saw them treat them. That is how them treat them. They encourage them to behave this way. Whosoever run this franchise encourage them to behave this way. Because they have nothing else for you to latch on to because they know you black people had that no love. Them actually make money off of you. Because them know say, that we as black people love. And we don't have no standard. This is a testament. This is something where we are bigger than Spice and Erica. This is how them value us as black people. Remember I said this recorded months ago. And them heard it the other day. A few days ago. You know why? Because they don't value us and we don't have no value. Because them already know say this we want to see. Them know say we no want to see nothing educational. Them know say we black people, not just Jamaican people now. We attack black Americans. We attack everybody worldwide. We log on to them platforms here. I log on to them social platforms here and them type of shows here. Them have the numbers, them for support it. Them have the data for prove it, say that we like. Them have the most views on the shows, them, where black people are fight. And them hear that and make money at our expense. Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. Could someone use such words against a Jew and him hear it? No, they would not hear it. 
MTV would not hear it. And the producers would have edited it out. They would have edited it. Wonder if you get to me, I say. They would not dare disrespect the Jews them. Whether she said it to one person or two persons or whatever, them not hear it. They might cut it out. And if somebody said it, maybe it did a leak out, it now come out not the show. Somebody maybe would have had it and leak it. Anonymous source leaked it. And it would have caused a big uproar and they would have cancelled the show. And MTV would have, would, would have already apologized for hearing it. Them no rate black people. Them no have no respect for black people. You know why? Because we no have no respect for ourselves. Because them take spice. And these girls. And the only thing them see you ladies as. Some like a degenerate will love fight. We cannot sit down and talk over things. We cannot sit down and have decent conversations. We can't solve problems with just words or reasoning. Them see it as the only solution to solve problems. Fight. And this is bigger than what everybody has run up and down and attack about. Oh, the girl get fired and she deserves to get fired and all of these things. It's bigger than that, people. Them already know that we don't value ourselves as black people. We don't have no value. So nobody now ever respect we. And that is the reason. These are the reasons why when you turn up for your job interview and you put say you're black on the paper, you, you don't get the call back. Them things are tied to it. Them now have no respect for you. Because you don't respect yourself. We don't have no standard. We still have the tenement yard mentality. All people when I grew up in a tenement yard and cuss and fight every day. After something, they come like a transfer to people. Yeah. I don't know if you understand what I'm going The only thing them say good about us is when we're fighting. Look on TikTok and those platforms when black people are fight. Numbers. Look at Facebook. Fight. Numbers. World star. Numbers. You see? Yes, when white people fight and them show it all over the internet. Them say, yo, them need some form of medical attention. And them say, oh, they were depressed and all. Even when black people get shot up by racial people or racist people. When them say about the racist people, they must shoot out the black people. Them, Oh, they were on medication. And they forget to take their medication or they didn't give them their medication. Oh, they didn't give him his medication. That's why he went and shoot up the store. Because I'm making no say we are not like that. Yeah. They might make you know, say, I snap the person, snap. But it's normal, as something normal for us as black people. Them know, say, yo, any given time, fight! Them just put on the camera, fight! Yeah. As a matter of fact, when black people see somebody on record, they get more angry. I want to fight more. They don't want to fight, they want to go viral. They want, you know, you know, you know, you know, world star, them start beat the shit out of each other more. And as that, is that them serious? Is that them serious? Understand that. We have no control over Safari Dick. So you have me up and you eat me because me and Amara was friend. But remember you and Nikki Baby was friend and you have a f Safari when you and Nikki Baby was friend and him was with Nikki Baby. Remember you and Estalita was friend and you know say Estalita and Safari did a f and you still go f him same way and then you run down the aisle so you feel like so when you did the married him and ever change. No, you have ball and a scream down the place and a talk about, oh my god, um, you know I'm a single mother, I'm a single mother too. And guess what, baby, I've been doing it for 14 years. So me and you talk and you couldn't talk to me because I ask you, where's your son? 
You're screaming on the place for this, for two children. You need to have the energy for this tree, a tree you have. So, you're vexed because, I say yes, your, your, your oldest son, not like you. Because you dropped him off and him at five. I I know you're not go back and pick him up. <laughs> Bitch, let me tell you something. Don't play with me. I'm not the one, two, nor the three. Erica, you start at something with the wrong person. I don't have no control over Safari Dick. So you have... I don't have no control. That is the part I show you. Know? People are making money off women calling each other bitch. Yep. Yep. Let me just get this off of my chest and say this real quick because I see another black so they might talk about say. Um, may I pick up for safari? May I pick up for safari? May I call a spade a spade? And may I talk the truth and speak it for what it is. Because I just feel for have a conversation with you. But you couldn't have the conversation with me because you never want to listen to the truth and the things that I have to tell you in your face because I don't fake like your friend them. Well, I listen to you and cry every day and I talk about, oh, oh, Safari doing this to me. Safari doing that to me, bitch. Do one of we a single mother too. And are you alone? Guess what? There's seven billion people in the world and you're not the first one where divorced. Like me tell you in your face. You're not the first woman where ever get divorced and you're not going to be the last. So what's the problem? Let me make sure I find a car now. Sorry. I love you too, baby. Sure. And that part I show you. Know? Yep, that part I show. Because I'm online, okay? I yes. Too. Let me make sure I clear this up because me here when I talk about. Um, one second. I love you, okay? Sorry, let me find a car that I had at the airport and hide. And talk about this real quick. Yeah. Oh my god. Real quick, let me um. So let me just explain something to you. Eric, come in, you're fake as fuck. You're sitting in front of my face and I laugh and I talk. But, oh, I love you so much. I was praying for you. And when you was dying, bitch, when you when I was dying and Safari was crying, you was acting ballistic in the house. Why are you crying for this bitch? Why are you crying for her? You wasn't crying for me. Like, what's the comparison? Whatever you have going on in your house, now have nothing to do with me, Erica. Whatever Safari is doing to you, you don't have nothing to do with me. So when you compare yourself, what's this jealousy over me? What's this jealousy over Safari like me? Me and him are just friends. Me not fucking baby. Baby, I'm... What do you think I'm right this one? I can't do a spice, I say, you know. She and Safari are ex husband in other house. And he was crying for spice during her time of um, sickness. And his wife. Got offended because him never cried for she. But how would that get out? Me and my woman are the house. Me and my woman are the house and we have an argument about who are crying and who are crying about and all them things. And it reached back on a reality show. Says she had a problem because him never did a cry for she. You know where that side is? The emasculated male. The emasculated black man. How the black man with them transform into a drama queen or a drama king. We are look content for stay in our show. We have to provide content for stay in our reality show. So them can continue to live the lifestyle where they want to live. Just check where I go on, man. It, people, stop look on the small picture about where Spice say who wrong, where Erica say who wrong. Yeah, the, 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 the racial, we don't we no support nobody. Whether blue, black, pink, yellow, green, monk, we don't support it, none at all. But look on the bigger picture, man. These people, they are some wannabe stars. Where them cast and throw them into this dramatic plot. See? 
And they have to provide content. Whatever the content is. You want your woman in the house and you are crying over a woman and she say, how come you don't cry over me like that? And I reach back to Spice. So Spice could have it now. To put in the show as content too. And of course, many of you may see it and many of you may disagree with me. They just call Spice as the angry black woman. The angry Jamaican, because what? They have a mentality say we are Jamaican people and we do a smoke weed and cause bad word. So every time you see Spice, she always a fight. Every time you see Spice, she always, it's like a, that, that them have to use to make we know say your Spice depend on the show. Then can script something gear or something. Just make sure you act and make sure you put forward our true talent. I wonder if we don't realize what I go on. It's just say, oh, it's Jamaican them, man. Yeah, them hard bumbo clot. Bumbo clot. Them have, we are just weed smoking bumbo clot Jamaicans. Even though Spice is a major celebrity in our, in our circle. You see? And maybe I make more money than we know for doing the punish show too. You see? But of course, you want to get exposure. Come because you as the angry Jamaican. The angry black Jamaican. So when you see Erica come now and I call her blue M-O-N-K-E-Y. I don't know something when you just click off the finger. I two of them perceived her. I two of them look upon her. I two of them, 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 them cast her. I two of them, them put her forward. As the angry Jamaican girl. You see? So that's why you have to understand, say. A man like Safari. Them have to do things to get content to put in on the show. A man. A black man. And it's long time they do it. Just my pal not jump all kind of sit in all kind of um, bikini, all kind of something to get content for putting on the show. Because the producers, them on the right, they, they have no writers and no producers to keep you entertained. Because now you have social media, your, your attention span is so limited, the only thing you're, 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 you're attracted to is black people killing each other, fighting each other, thumping on each other, spit on each other, call each other racial names, call each other bitch and all of them something. They don't love it. And people just exploit, you know. And no says, that you know love? From is that you love, we're going to give you what you love. They, they, they're doing what's selling. You see what I say? But guess what? The Jewish people are not going to tolerate that. The Muslim community, you cannot. They could have never, nobody on the show could never say something bad about Allah or Muhammad and MTV broadcast it. They could have never said something bad about our derogatory or whatever about Allah or Muhammad and the producers for the show send it out like that. Them that take it out. That would have, somebody would have to leak it. And the show would have been cancelled. The Jews them, as a matter of fact, if somebody on the show had said something so out of line about the LGBTQ community, they would have not heard it. But them have no respect for Spice. Because it's the big Jamaican girl. Where them always have we as bumbo clot, weed smokers. Yeah, the big loud mouth Jamaican girl, excuse me. You can't understand what, we can't understand what she's saying because her accent is so strong. So we can't, she, she, she don't, she cannot, she's not connecting with the audience that we're trying to sell her to. So we're gonna cast her for what they can understand. The big loud mouth Jamaican girl. Bumbo clot. Ganja smokers. You see? Because they're not, they're not no patience for try to figure out what we are saying based on with dialect. They ain't got no patience for that. You go and do an interview, we have to up your twanging like, yeah, man, you know what, uh, yeah, 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 I'm telling you, man, yeah, you have to go up there. Is they have no patience to learn what we are saying. 
or to understand what we're saying. Even sometimes they don't fucking understand. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, yeah, man, yeah, man, and turn it into a joke. They're not trying to understand what we're saying. They have no patience. Even your co-workers, them, you're talking Jamaican to them. Yeah, man, yeah, man. They don't understand what you're saying. And say, did you, did you, did you hear what I just said? Yeah, man, yeah, man. Bamba clad. Turn it into a joke. Promise you 100% and a million dollars. Me love looking me not gone to bed. Me not fuck safari. Me not fuck him, baby. You have to get it in your head. Because you, you, you play victim. Everywhere you go, you have screamed on the place. I invited to my gala. And I invited you to eat in a Miami. You come. Hi, baby. Me just have to try to finish the life before the, before the flight. Welcome. Front of your face. I'm not fake like you. All of the shit them where you do behind my back, I heard. Me hear about it. Them come back to me and them tell me. Me know say you're fake. So when me see you, you're all spice. I love you so much. I'm just high and cut and go through. It's for a reason. It's because me know say you're fake. Me, me hear all of the shit where you, where you talk about me. You come on my gala. You scream down the place and talk about safari. Ray, ray, ray. Oh my God. And you, you're safari divorced one year now. And you're still a fuck him. And that's the problem. And because me tell you, say, you're still a fuck safari. Because you're going to tell me, say, oh, me, 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 me talk about this faggot. One become fuck up, up to last month, him still a fuck you. You and him still a fuck. So, what the problem? I don't understand. You're vexed with me. You hear that? That's what we brothers them become, you know. Every time them fuck, them have to cheer it. So, she can't tell the world now, say, our last month, them, that, we come, that we are now, you know. Yeah, that we are now. Anything nowadays we can do as black people. Because these are what people interested in. Uh, about us. Who are fuck, who, who are suck, who, who are this, who are that, who are kill, who, who are fight, who, who bad mind, who, all of them things. Uh. Let's understand what's going on, man. It's like them, them are feed with brothers them for some estrogen. Like them are give them too much soy product. Is what I say? Mm hmm. Yeah, man. Come here, Amara, a friend. I'm becoming my Miami. I'm here to talk to Amara. Amara was my friend before she got there with Safari. Hi, Jesus Christ. He was friend and he was with Nikki baby. Remember, your Estalita was friend and you know, say Estalita and Safari did a fuck and you still go fuck him same way and then you run down the aisle. So you feel like so when you did marry him, you got change. Now you're balling a scream. What are you going to learn from this? This is where them perceived us to be. The people who sit down on the car and sit down around us and go around us and just gossip all day and chat all day and chat that one the business and chat that one the business and so 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 and mix up, mix up, mix up. Is that them take and put in our show, you know? Is that them take and put into a show and make money off of black people because them know say yo we have so much time for we hand for just sit down and so 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 gossip gossip chatu 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 he say she say she say we say they say who say we say and we say I just they know us as that they don't say just gossip like sit and talk people business that, 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 that's all they see us as some look some look waste people that's all them see us as you see I don't them take and put in a show oh my god oh, FYI this is. is this is something in the public domain for anybody have a problem with it or not. This is a part of the show. This is actually, rec this was recorded for the show. This is a, this is pa a part of one of the series. So when you all thought that she was just in the airport talking her mind, no, this is a part of the show. Yeah. It's, it's, it's just, it's a, they have to, she's traveling and she has to be providing content. To stay up to date with the show. And they want her to do this. They want her to speak like this. Because this is going to make people watch the show. This is going to draw the, the, the Caribbean people them, them need for your, for your viewers to. And you're going to, you, you understand? They, they want this. They, they want the, the footage has to, you have to send in your, whatever you do, you have to send in your portion of the footage. Send in your footage, like you're sending your partner money. Send in your footage so we can edit and have the show ready to air. You see? 
That's the part of the show. Too, and guess what, baby? I've been doing it for 14 years. So me and you talk and you couldn't talk to me because I ask you, where's your son? Yes, clean down the place for this for two children. You need to have the energy for this tree. A tree you have. So you're vexed because me say yes, your 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 oldest son not like you. Because you drop him off on him at five. All part of the show. Even bring the children them into it. You bring the children them into it, it's all a part of the show. And guess what? The angry black women are cussing, fighting, calling each other names, racial slur, and you want know. The franchise is just reaping the reward. Just getting the money. Just take the money off of them. So you can talk about your kids, ladies. Ladies on the show, hi. You can bring your kids in. You can talk about your kids. And this is not like a social media platform where people just come and just hear out them laundry because everybody have problems and just come talk about them problems. This is actually somebody exploiting. This is exploitation. Exploiting the angry black woman. Exploiting the mix-up corner, the mix-up black woman. This is what it is. So you can even bring your kids into it. Of course, all good footage. Yeah, man, bring the kids into it. Good footage. Yeah, okay. The, I like that part. I like that part. Yeah, don't edit that part out. Don't edit that part out. That's going to be something for her to fight for. Yes, yes. Got it. Got it. Two, three, one. Got it. Got it. Real good footage. We, I, I really like what you sent in. I love the part. Because <laughs> some of the producers, them come from the Atlanta too, you know, and they know them, you know, they, 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 you know, them already work on them with the, with the estrogen thing. You understand? If, you know, them already work on enough of the producers, them, the black producers, them, were behind the scene, you know, say, it's a spice. Yeah. Can I get the footage today? Yeah. That's something there. Yeah. Uh, you know what I really liked about the footage that you sent? I'm gonna tell you, the footage that you sent, I love it. When you talk about her son, I've been knowing the bit. Girl, I've been knowing that she girl. Girl, I've been knowing that she girl. Yeah. yeah. Cha ching ching. And of course, you know, when somebody bring your children into anything, you know, say anything I go come out of your mouth. You see? Just like when you're fighting and a knife then near and you grab the knife and stab. Just like when you're fighting and the chair then near and you grab the chair and you fling it. And you bust the person's head. And you say, Lord God, me I spent six months in a jail to bust the person's head. Oh my God, me should have to think about it. But I say, go eat at the moment. You see what I say? And if you have a little, if you have a little, if you have a little racism in you, it will come out that time the too. And of course the producers them know say so you have a little racism in you too. And them know so you think that because you are that, you know, from a, a different race, they know that they, they know that like a provocation about the children gonna draw that out of you because they already know. So you have a little racist thing about you. Because of course, even your baby daddy, your ex-husband told them that you are racist. So what them can do to trigger this out now? We could, we could get it out there. Good footage, good footage. Boom. Money, teaching, Viral. Boom. Everybody talking about the show. Mm-hmm. And we are here, up in our feelings, talking about, oh, she called her a, a blue monk. Oh, yeah, man, it's, it's good that they cancel her. No, 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 no. Them just cut off a little branch off of the tree. It looks like a branch come off of the tree, and the tree is still alive and well. It's grow back, grow back by next week. It's going to grow back by next week. New episode, they find somebody more dramatic than Erica. Our space is so valuable right now. Everybody want to fill that void. They already have people, to, they already have somebody to play a part. They already know so she have that in her. To say these things, of course, tell her about our children. Oh, good footage, good footage. I, I, I like that. You know, you're really connecting with the audience right now. And I love, I really love how you're connecting with the, with the audience right now. I like that. What you said, I, I, you know, you know what? I know this a long time ago about our children. I didn't want to say, I'm glad you said it, girl. <laughs> yep. Footage. Uh uh, no, you're not go back to pick him up. Bitch, let me tell you something. Don't clear with me. I'm not the one, two, nor the three. 
Erica, you start a summer with the wrong person. My people, they... Once you're a Jamaican, start a bitch, 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 bitch. You know, so she get Americanized. Let's be truthful. I know so Jamaican people talk. We say, hey, girl. Yeah. And when Jamaican girl, I go say, that's the girl. What's the use of that? Bitch, 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 bitch. Hey, bitch, hey, bitch. You know, so them get Americanized. Program. Yeah. I'm an old self. Because I get a new life, I'm going to tell myself say, I will never be like this again. But uh, you make me go back to my old life. Because you see, I want it with me, I don't know if it's done. You know. I don't know if it's done. You start up something where you have a regret so you start it up. You know. Because guess what? You see, when we're going to the scene earlier, and you flip over the table, you flip it over because you never want me to talk. Because you try to silence me. Because you know, say, out of everybody for love and for franchise me. I one of them, I don't hold my mouth. I never talk the truth and never speak the facts to you. You hear that? Plug. Plug. Love and hip-hop franchise. Plug. Drama. Plug. You hear what she said? You flip over the table. The table don't flip already, people. And this is three months ago. And the table flip already. When we are see this, the table flip already. They already flipped the table and those racial slurs were echoed prior to she saying this. But I'll give you something better. Let me give you something better. You see what Spice was concerned about? You see what she was concerned about? You see what her contention was? That the girl is fake. That the girl has a problem with her ex-husband loving Spice more in her times of sickness. Spice did not come out and let us know that this woman call her a, black, a blue monk. Because you expect if somebody call me a blue monk, such a racial, you know, Disgusting, derogatory, such racial derogatory words, discriminating words, you know, say, I'm going to, I don't think you're, 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 you and do it behind my back because that's what you do. You talk shit about me behind my back, and when you see me in my face, you want to laugh and act like me and your friend. Bitch, you're fake as fuck. Get the fuck out of here, bitch. I'm going to tell you the truth. To your face, I'm in a care. Because I'm not looking nothing from you. I'm not looking nothing from love and hip hop. He's a real fucking artist. Outside of the show, on camera and off camera. Hi, baby. Sure. Yeah. So I don't want people to say I'm picking up for Safari because it has nothing to do with me picking up for Safari. I am just speaking facts to the face. Something where some people can't do. And that caused the fiction and that's the problem because some girls fake and them don't want me to tell them the truth to them face. Erica, go look for your gynecologist. Go look for your gynecologist. Infection and yam you out. Your pussy is full of syphilis. You have lymphogranuloma vulgaris. Girl, don't play with me. Go get some calistin. Don't play with me, Erica. I'm not stay on this too long either. I just want to talk my mind and tell Erica, say, remember me tell you, every time I see you, you better be prepared for flip over the table. Yeah. So I don't want people to say I'm picking up for safari because it has nothing to do with me picking up for safari. I am just speaking facts to the face, something where some people can't do, and that caused the fiction and that's the problem because some girls fake and them don't want me to tell them the truth to them face. Erica, go look for your gynecologist. Go look for your gynecologist. Infection and yam you out. Your pussy is full of syphilis. You have lymphogranuloma vulgaris. Girl, don't play with me. Go get some calistin. Don't play with me, Erica. I'm not stay on this too long either. I just want to talk my mind and tell Erica, say, remember me tell you, every time I see you, you better be prepared for flip over the table because me is not the one to play with. I'm going to do fake storyline. I'm going to do fakeness. 
everything about me is 100% real. 100%. And you, you have to do this for get storyline, but remember me tell us, the wrong story you pick up, baby. And the wrong story you want. You never want that story. Yeah. You should have never picked up that story. Yeah. You see Bambi of the season? This season, leave her with it. Don't try flipping the script. You hear me I tell you? Better you leave her with it and call it a day. Because you need some canny stain. I don't know where you come act like say. But this not have nothing to do with me. I don't care about my for business, but Safari. I don't care about what you want him have going on and where you have got through. And I don't want nobody come say, I pick me, I pick up for Safari. No, I have my own issues and my own problem. I'm nearly dead. I still have my issues and my problem I deal with. You walk and play victim here and see your ball. Oh, me, me, a single mother. Bitch, I'm one, too. I am one, too. 14 years. And guess what? I pick up myself and do what I have to do. And you have to do the same. That me have to, that, that me have to sing and tell you, you know, Erica, pick your pussy up off of the ground. Catch a break. Let me breathe. Jesus Christ. Oy. Erica, pick up your pussy off of the ground and keep it moving. It's not the end of the road, baby. It's not the end of life. We all, people married and them get divorced. People do relationship, them break up. Me break up with my relationship. I'm in and dead. I'm breathing. Look at me. I'm alive. It's okay. You can get over it. It's fine. People divorce all the time. What the fuck you up here, victim? And I act like you want me to take it up on my head. Bitch, me not take it up on my head. Safari, I fuck Amara. Them there with Amara. I mean, I know him want Amara. Not my problem. What does that have to do with me? What does that have to do with me? Your dicks are come talk about. Don't talk about my son. Don't talk about my son. Yes, we're going to talk about it. Since you say you're a single mother, me I tell you, say, me a single mother for 14 years. And you're going to say, oh, but I'm a single mother for how much years? I don't know how old your son is. So I said, where is he? Because I'm not like you. Where your son? Where your oldest son? Because you act like a two kids. You have the same energy. Where you have for your two kids, you need to have the same energy for three. So we are asking you the question and we wait for the answer. Where is your oldest son? Why you not have the same energy for your third child? What? Mm. That may I ask you, you come talk. Like, say, so you think my friend will tell it to your face. So, what I'm to you? Bitch, you think my friend that you're not the blood clot story, like, I'm not the fake story. So, it's on for me. So, I'm still going to talk to you, come turn over blood clot table because you want to have a one up. You want to have a storyline. You want to feel like you're big, bitch. Oi, go. Oi, go. You can't talk in my face. Come talk in my face when I hear what your office says. Talk in my face, can't have no secret about me. If you want a gynecologist number, you can't get it. Since as you come like your age, can you can it still say can it still sell over the counter? Fuck wrong with you. You come talk. The one a woman left with. Everybody people get born all the time. Wake up and taste the blood clad coffee. It's not the end of the day. You walk a ball down the place and come on a fucking gala ball and I scream in the hallway and I come talk about safari like every day somebody want to talk about safari. Every day for safari, this safari, this I don't give a fuck about safari dick. When you did a fuck your friend man, you never did a thing about him dick. Bitch, fucking play with me. I'm calm down in the people in the airport. So when you stop talking about me, I pick up for safari because it's not about picking up for safari. It's about speaking facts and call a spade a spade and talking the truth the same way all me see it. I'm done talking the truth already, bitch. You're not the, you're not the first woman. You're not going to be the last, bitch. And I can tell it to your face and I ask you and I say, where your oldest son there? Where him there? Where him there? And I ask you, where him there? Hi, sorry. Sorry, I had to play the whole thing. Let me tell you why I played the whole thing. Because I wanted to hear Spice talk about how dare you come call me a blue M O N K E Y. We never even know she said that. If this never hear, we'd even know she did call her a blue monk. I wonder if you don't realize what I go on. And what you take away from that? Boy, you're looking at storyline. All of them, storyline, all of them are look. It's storyline Erica did a look. Storyline Spice a look when she in the airport I said them things here. Storyline Safari a look. Storyline all of them a look. All of them a look storyline. Them go do surgery and try kill off themselves. Them go do surgery and transform them figure. Them go do surgery and fix them face. Them go do surgery and mash up them body. Them would them them would them, them, them kill themselves and make a storyline. I said it. Them girls yeah, with them franchise here, I exploit, will kill themselves. To make a storyline. 
Don't get to no feelings involved, my people. This is what they signed up for. You see? This is what these ladies signed up for. To put forward or to get storylines to stay on these shows. If them not bringing in the numbers, it's just the same way. How the Europeans them going at the Congo and the, and the Africans them, the Congolese people them, had to bring certain amount of rubber. If they don't bring the amount of rubber, them chop off them hand and them foot. It's just modern day exploitation or modern day slavery. But them just find other ways to make money off of them. That is the reason why them have to look the storyline. Because the storyline brings the viewers and bringing them checks, bringing the money. Don't get enough feelings caught up in them thing, people. We don't have to know it's a deeper thing. It's deeper, people. Don't lose no sleep over that girl calling Spice, what she call her. And things say this is just about Erica. This is deeper than even Erica. Erica does have a little thing in her where she feel like it's because she has a little light complexion. She's better than the dark skinned people. Them. As, as she alone have it, a lot of them have it. A lot of them are right, right, where the border, where the border in Hispaniola. Yeah, them have, a, them have that same. Um, type of thinking, the mentality. It's something we're embedded in them system. It's a, it's a, it's not a new problem. It's something that is embedded in them system. Right across the border, Haiti is right there. Dominican Republic is right there. With the, the even if they, they, they mixed by blood, them see the dark skin as, you know, inferior to, to the light skin people. It's, it's, it's something that is deeply embedded in our, in our, in our psyche and in our, in our, in our, in our people. Them. It's nothing new. You understand? So it's exploitation. This is exploitation. They exploit these black sisters. It's a massive. Because the whole of them are black people, you know. Contrary to what they believe, you know. Because they believe that because you're a Latino, which is not even a real thing. They believe that because you're a Latino, you're some different race from a, from, from a, from a Negro. You know, it's the same thing. You know, you just, you just, you know, your, 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 your poor parents or your ancestors, you know, the, the, the Spaniards, them are these people them from Spain, when they call Spaniards or Spanish. They, they came and they, Interbreed with the Africans and, and, and you come out and, and through interbreeding and interbreeding and breeding and breeding and breeding, you became lighter, 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 lighter. So you go from to, you know, to, to, from, from, from Molotov to, to all of them something and you go down the line. It's just that, that's what's happening. But it's way bigger than what we are, we're seeing on the surface, people. And do you realize, just take away this, no man. Just take away these people. Just don't make people on the internet get you all up into your feelings and make you losing sleep and let you go in cussing out people and you're there talking stuff on the internet. Just, just, just understand what's going on. Notice this. At no point in this rant, Spice mentioned the storyline. The racial storyline. Because she would have given it away. Before the show aired. This is a game. This is something that they're playing. With you. Mentally. Just listen to people man. Just don't go like an idiot man. Notice at no point. Even Spice. Is a part of this plot. Spice said this three months ago and at no point in this rant she spoke about what the woman said about her as an African woman. Just get that now in her head now man. At no point. You see? She did not mention once said the woman called her a racial slur or whatever. I used a racial slur against her. Don't get fooled. Don't get used. Stay woke. Big up on yourself.